Tonight, the chairman of the Roanoke County School Board has a stark warning for people. Mike Ray spent eight days in the hospital with COVID-19 and wasn't sure if he would survive. 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer shares his story as Ray is now recovering at home. And he actually shared with me and he broke down a little bit and it got me a little emotional that he actually didn't know whether he was going to live or die. Roanoke County School Board member Don Butzer sharing the harrowing details of his colleague and friend, School Board Chair Mike Ray's battle with COVID-19. The division announcing Tuesday Ray spent eight days in the hospital, catching it outside school. He was uh, given uh, uh, lots of courses of different kinds of drugs, but the most concerning thing was that they couldn't get his his oxygen, oxygen levels up. Ray's family called 911 when his indicators turned for the worst. Tonight, he tells 10 News he's still pretty weak and shared with Butzer about how his stay on the COVID floor at Roanoke Memorial went. He talked about the, the loneliness of being on the COVID ward. Uh, he talked about uh, the isolation, uh, no visitors. He shared with me that there were people dying on the ward. And he knew that. In a statement, Ray said in part, I now have firsthand experience with the coronavirus, and I can tell you it's nothing to take lightly. We all must be serious and vigilant about wearing masks, being physically distanced, and washing hands. He finished with, trust me, you do not want this. The division is using this opportunity to double down on its safety messaging. While not everyone will get it this bad, Ray says he's an example of what can happen. It's sort of um, a Russian roulette. You just never know. And uh, it has hit him hard. Um, he has difficulty even getting through a sentence uh, without uh, showing that he's, he's distressed. In Roanoke County, Shane Dwyer, 10 News, working for you. School leaders continue to monitor positivity and infection rates in the community, but as of right now, say there's no significant transmission in the classroom.